I am Captain Steve, and I have a confession to make. I am a cat person. There, I said it. I love catamarans. There are a lot of reasons why, but let me tell you my top six features. Number one has to be stability and comfort. You're not going to be sitting in bed. A boat goes by, and it's going to roll you right off the bed. This boat has a 21-foot, 8-inch beam. That's half the length. It's unbelievable how stable this is, so you're going to have a restful sleep through the night. Number two, shallow draft. This boat's got a three foot six inch draft. You can get into all the little hidey holes in shallow places in the Bahamas. Great feature to have and one less thing to worry about. Number three, spaciousness. There's no way you're gonna find the room of a catamaran on a monohull. You take a 40 foot monohull, add 50% at least to the interior space. And now you're starting to talk about what you get with the catamaran. Number four, versatility. You can do so much with this boat. Cruising, island hopping, it's a great entertainment platform. It takes six people on a cruise. It takes two people on a cruise. It takes, what, 30 on a party? So much space, so much room, so much versatility. Number five, maneuverability. With the engines so far apart from each other on a catamaran, there is so much torque. When you go to use those engines, one in forward, one in reverse, it just pivots the boat so much nicer. And when you're coming into a dock, if you put one into reverse, it not so much pulls the boat to one side, but brings the boat back and steers it a little bit. Whereas if you had a model hull and the engines were close together, you'd be doing much more of a turning capability. With that, it lets you practically deal cards when you're coming into the dock. It's unbelievable. And number six, fuel efficiency. With two narrow hulls going through the water, they slice right through anything cleanly and you've got incredible efficiency. Let's talk about how much. In the case of the Leopard 40 PC, she has a top speed of 20.3 knots, which translates into 0.5 nautical miles per gallon. Drop her back just a bit and she shows 0.6 nautical miles per gallon, down to 3200 RPM. And then she'll linger at 0.7 nautical miles per gallon, all the way down to 2400 RPM and 10 knots. That's where her 370 gallon fuel capacity will carry her for 238.7 nautical miles, while still keeping a 10% reserve in the bank. That's why we're seeing more and more of these yachts in the Great Loop. So given all those factors, it's easy to see why I am such a cat fan. You will be too, as soon as you get on one. There's just no going back. I'm Captain Steve, and I'll see you on the water.